Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am your friend Muhammad Danas, studying in Sri Venkateswara College of Engineering. In this video, we are going to deal with principles of communication system. Now, in this video, we are going to deal also with modulation index and percentage of modulation index. Introduction: Modulation index and percentage of modulation are essential parameters in the field of signal processing. They play a crucial role in determining the quality and efficiency of a modulated signal. Understanding these concepts is crucial for engineers and technical workers in telecommunications and audio processing. The modulation index and percentage of modulation. The modulation index definition. The modulation index is dimensionless quantity that defines the extent of modulation in a signal. It is calculated as the ratio of peak amplitude of modulating signal to the peak amplitude of carrier signal. The higher modulating index intakes a more significant deviation of carrier signal from its original state. The modulation it depends on the amplitude of modulating signal and amplitude of carrier signal. This is the modulation index of amplitude modulation. Modulation index is defined as the ratio of maximum change in the amplitude of carrier signal to the amplitude of carrier signal. Okay, this is the modulated signal. Important of modulation index. Modulation index directly affects the bandwidth of the modulated signal. It determines the signal to noise ratio, yes, and R, and overall quality of modulated signal. Proper adjustment of modulation index is crucial for efficient signal transmission and reciprocation. Reception, sorry. For an amplitude modulation signal, the carrier is 10 cos omega t. And the message signal is AM cos omega t, omega mt. It takes the numeric value of modulation index u and sketch the diagram of the modulated wavelength AM is equal to 4 and AM is equal to 20. It is the problem that we have solved in the previous video. Types of modulation indicates in amplitude modulation am the modulation index is typically donated as m okay in frequency modulation fm the modulation index is donated as beta in phase modulation pm modulation index is donated as theta analog modulation modulation index m for amplitude modulation am Okay. For amplitude modulation AM, it is donated as M. For frequency modulation FM, it is donated as beta. And for phase modulation PM, it is donated as gamma, not theta, sorry. It is gamma, okay. The percentage of modulation, the definition of percentage of modulation is it is a measure of the peak amplitude deviation of modulated signal from the carrier signal. It is calculated as the modulation index multiplied by 100. The percentage of modulation provides a simple way to qualify the extent of modulation in a signal. The image is not as visual. I try it. To put more effective images in the upcoming videos. Try to cooperate with it. 
the relationship between modulation index and percentage of modulation the modulation index and percentage of modulation are directly proportional to each other the higher modulation index results in a higher percentage of modulation four parameters provides insight into the modulation depth of signal in i a higher modulation index results in higher percentage of modulation both parameters such as this the modulation index of percentage of modulation are directly proportional to each other and second a higher modulation index results in higher percentage of modulation this both the parameters provide insight into the modulation depth of the signal it provide the insight modulation depth of the signal occurs applications of modulation index and percentage of modulation in radio broadcasting broadcasting the modulation index ensures optimal signal transmission and reception in radio processing the percentage of modulation help to maintain audio quality in the radar system modulation indicates are crucial for target detection and tracking the effects factor affecting modulation index and percentage of modulation but what are the factor that affect the modulation index and percentage of modulation first one signal amplitude variation first one signal amplitude variations of signal amplitude affect the modulation in index and percentage of modulation second one modulating signal frequency and third one carrier signal frequency yes how we are going to calculate the modulation index and percentage of modulation for am am is equal to a max minus am a minimum means m for amplitude modulation m is equal to a maximum minus a minimum divided by a maximum plus a minimum okay where a max is the peak of amplitude of the modulated signal and a minimum is the minimum of amplitude to find the percentage of fm a maximum minus a minima divided by a maxima plus a minima into 100 for frequency modulation pm is equal to beta is equal to delta f by delta m where delta f is the frequency deviation and fm is the modulating signal frequency the percentage of modulation is equal to modulation index in this for a for the am a maxima minus a minima divided by a maxima plus a minima for fm a delta f by fm is equal to uh, this is the modulation index by multiplying with 100 we get the percentage of the modulation this is the fed mod modulation important in communication system what is important in communication system of what is important of modulation index and percentage of modulation in communication system what the critical role it plays we are going to see in this lecture modulation index and percentage of modulation are crucial for ensuring efficient communication system they help optimize bandwidth utilize and minimize interference proper modulation parameters leads to improve signal clarity and reliability thank you for watching my video please like and subscribe in this common in this book pcs we are commonly deal with the communication system modulation index the wave Message signal, carrier signal, which we are going to see in the upcoming video.
Thank you for watching my video. Please like and subscribe for the next.